Hey everybody, it's Alan, and I hope that you are doing well. Today is February 12th, and that is the birthday of Mr. Gilmore, the drummer of one of my favorite bands, Triumph. So in celebration of his birthday, we're actually going to listen to two Triumph songs. We're going to listen to a very, very, very early track called Don't Take My Life. We're going to follow that up with a track from the album Sport of Kings called Hooked on You.
Okay. I wasn't actually going to stop between songs on this, but it's been a while since I've heard the song Don't Take My Life. And as I was listening to it, I remembered this part right here. Actually, this part and that part. Actually, prior to that, <laughs> this part. entire ending of the guitar solo that whole riff frankly the that whole part including the bill that whole part right there repeats in a later track. And I think they use that during the live performances or usually when they would do live performances of the song. I want to say it's the song. Uh, it's not Never Surrender. It's um, Fight the Good Fight, I believe. I think it's Fight the Good Fight. Go watch the live 1983 US Festival performance of Fight the Good Fight. And you'll see that little section there where Rick Emmett is running back and forth across the stage with his famous hollow body playing that exact progression in the middle of Fight the Good Fight. I think it's Fight the Good Fight. I am almost, almost 100% positive that it's Fight the Good Fight. Anyway, I just wanted to point that out before we move on to the next track, which of course is off of Sporta Kings, and it's the song Hooked on You. Hooked on you. 
So the Sport of Kings album was my entry point for the band Triumph. I had heard them on the radio locally before that, heard songs like Magic Power and Allied Forces on, on local radio. But it was the Sport of Kings album that was the first one that I purchased. And I then absolutely fell in love with Rick Emmett's guitar playing, read all of the articles that he wrote for Guitar Player Magazine as a columnist, um, learned many lessons from the man from those Guitar Player Magazine uh, columns. And then I, I would go back in and go back and listen to, re-listen to, you know, the Thunder 7 album and Allied Forces, and I'd listen to Magic Power, and I'd listen to, you know, basically all of the early stuff, too. And uh, my favorite personal album is the Thunder 7 album. Love that album. I know it's not a lot of people's favorite, but I love that. That, to me, has got, that's got my favorite favorite triumph song on it um stranger in a strange land as much as i love magic power as much as i love hold on as much as i love little boy blue stranger in a strange land to me is kind of triumph's perfect composition but the thunder uh, sorry the sport of kings album is my entry point and i l must have listened to this cassette tape on repeat over and over and over again for weeks on end for a long time and until the tape broke and i had to go buy another one actually now that i remember um i just i, I love the band triumph i actually loved the band triumph long before i ever really was impacted by the band rush so when it comes right down to it i knew about rush but when it comes right down to it my first first Canadian trio was Triumph. And um, so, like I said, Rick Emmett's a guitar hero of mine. And I always appreciated Gilmore, but but obviously, you know, I don't think you can compare Gilmore to, uh, to, um, to Neil Peart. And I don't think you should try. <laughs> um, with that said, you know, it's Gilmore's birthday, and it was just fun going back and listening to a couple of uh, Triumph songs and specifically ones that I probably don't normally listen to because I tend to lean towards listening to Rick Emmett sing over Gilmore sing. So it's kind of fun going back and listening to some Gilmore vocal tracks. So hope you enjoyed that. Happy birthday to Gilmore. Please feel free to leave a comment in the comment section below. We can talk about it further. Just know that I truly appreciate you all, and I wish you well. Take care.